Hi, I'm Odessa, and today I'm going to try and spend 24 hours homeless. Well, all I will have is this backpack, which contains extra warm gear, some homework, flashlight, and a blanket. Non-homeless me is going to donate $5 to homeless me, so thank you very much. That's very kind. I'm gonna head off to Camrose and see if I can live homeless. With me is my sister Callista, and she's gonna help with videoing and keeping me company. Here we are outside, homeless, and official start time is 9.46. Right now, just starting out, the thing I think will be most difficult will be the boredom. Um, I'm pretty used to having computer, all that stuff for entertainment, so I'm a little concerned as to what I will actually do for 24 hours. Yeah, in a couple hours we'll check in and see how we're feeling. So it's 11.45, we've been outside for two hours now, and it is snowing as you can see, which the weatherman promised me would not happen today, so I'm not impressed with his skills. It is now 1.43. We walked all the way to the mall and then around in that area. Pretty much because we found that walking helps you stay warm. And Krista's going to go home and I'll be on my own for a bit and that'll be fun. So. And it's still about minus two miles. Okay, so for the past few hours I've been inside the mall. Now my friend Mark is here so we're going to continue on the adventure. It's about 5.30 more or less. I'm not even 12 hours into my 24 hours so that's discouraging but I've put on more warm things here and hopefully be good. So it's nine o'clock roughly. We're almost at 12, 12 hours of homelessness. It's not a lot of fun and right now our main goal is to find somewhere to sleep. <laughs> Having never slept outside I am unfamiliar with what I am looking for and I just want to go to sleep. Okay, so we have one spot here, but we think it's private property. Um, it's kind of just like a little place behind a building. So isn't it kind of weird how like, you know, we're not actually probably doing anything wrong, but like, you sort of you feel... You totally feel like you're doing something wrong? Yeah, and it's like, no one can even tell that we're actually homeless, homeless. right? But like, you just feel like everyone's like looking at you and... You totally feel like everybody knows you're homeless. All right, it's 8.30ish in the morning. Um, we kind of cheated and slept inside for a bit last night because we're not very good at being homeless and we couldn't find anywhere to sleep. So now we are hanging out at a park to kill time until it's been 24 hours, even though the 24 hour part doesn't really apply, I guess, anymore. But you know, that's what we're gonna do. So we have a a little over an hour and we're then going to walk to Mark's car and be unhomeless. How am I feeling right now? My legs hurt. The only way I'm walking is because I know it's like only a few more steps. <laughs> Mark's car! 9.38. Ah, uh, seven minutes. Seven minutes of homelessness. To reflect upon this. Um, not fun. Harder than I thought. Yes. Much harder than I thought. I completely understand now why people do the couch surfing thing as opposed to the homeless thing. Like as much <laughs> as it's really probably humiliating to be like, I need a place to stay. You need a place to stay. You actually need a place to stay. I'm tired. <laughs> 
and cold. And this was a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. 1945, yeah! Yay! <laughs> happy news! I have a home again! I'm so happy! You people think I'm just crazy, but I'm really, really happy! <laughs> and I want to go home. <laughs> so we're gonna go home.